as an addendum to the the Milo uh, fake charity story, which, which again he's collected about a hundred thousand dollars, but hasn't set up, uh, hasn't dispersed any of the money or set up any kind of nonprofit status. It's just went straight into his bank account. He's going to uh, buy a boat called the SSSS. <laughs> Uh, one person who actually donated money to the Milo Yabadabaduopoulos privilege grant, who's not mad at all about um, this supposed quote-unquote hoax, is sort of spiritual godfather of Chapo Trap House, uh, Gorilla Mindset founder Mike Cernovich. The greatest philosopher of our time. <laughs> Mike Cernovich changed all of our lives. Like, Will, Will quit his job because he read Gorilla Mindset. Yeah, hell yeah. And it was like that changed my life. Yeah, my Mike was like, uh, "Do you think that a modern day ape would work in publishing?" And Will was like, "Hell no, that shit's gay." <laughs> I was. That's why he lives in. Uh, that's why he lives in Prospect Park and scavenges for uh, expired fruit from garbage cans. <laughs> yeah, I was living a chimp lifestyle at best. Mike, you helped me lead a gorilla lifestyle that I'm on now, silverback ape status. But yeah, no. Uh, Mike actually, Michael uh, shared um, a receipt and he says, as an actual donor to the privilege grant, let me address the media's latest hoax against Milo Yanniopoulos. And he shared a screenshot of a receipt that says, Dear Mike Cern- Michael Cernovich, this is a receipt for your gracious donation. Organization, Milo Gives Back, amount $2,500. Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. I could grip Cernovich so good. Cernovich gave... Any one of us could just get this guy's entire... Uh, like, we could we could turn his, uh, his, uh, his, what, alimony into an annuity and just get give it and turn it into a lump sum and have him give it to us in, in a weekend. <laughs> so Mike, Mike Cernovich is an uh, uh, alpha gorilla is not mad about this at all. In fact, he's mad at the media for um, creating this fake controversy as they do. He writes, Milo started a scholarship fund as his public profile was rising. I was one of the first donors. The story today is a hoax. He continues. How is it a hoax? He can well. Mike is going to tell he you. He hasn't distributed any money to any scholarship <laughs> well, people. Matt, he's going to tell you. He says using his newfound fame for good, Milo started a scholarship fund. However, his profile went up ten times from the day he started it. When your star rises the way Milo has, you realize that finding honest, competent people who can manage your affairs is almost impossible. Which is why he has forty interns um, writing everything he <laughs> says online. But that's hard to come by. It's hard to come by 40 people who will do that kind of work for you for free. Um, Milo told me, an actual donor, that he was falling behind and that the scholarships would be delayed. He told that to, to Cernovich personally, but he didn't tell it to um, and He told that to the people who donated more than $2,000. Um, continuing, the hoaxing media, of course, did not ask me, an actual donor, amazing that they didn't call up Cernovich for a quote, <coughs> What was going on? They instead lied about Milo. The media is going to media. Milo works far harder than most realize. I didn't realize until visiting him in Alaska. He works even harder than I do. Long story short, anyone hinting that Milo took money is lying. I say this as a donor. The hoaxing media wants to discredit him. The... Excuse me. Fuck. (laughs) The hoaxing media wants to discredit him. The end. So... It's yeah no. Cernovich um, acknowledges that not a dime of the money has been used for a charitable purpose, but he he just knows that Milo is working too hard and he's falling behind like we all do. Yeah, sometimes when you collect money for your charity, because of stress, uh, stress is part of like becoming a gorilla. You accidentally embezzle all of it. It's happened before. Uh, okay, so uh, the Clinton Foundation, right? Another perfect example. G- does great work. Does great work. Like they, I don't know really what they do. I think they like go into third world countries and try to give kids autism. I'm not really sure. <laughs> but like, hey, look, sometimes a Saudi gives you $20 million and you don't really know what happened to it because we're just, look, we're all trying to do our best out there, okay? And Dude, just, some, like, 
It not dude. N- nobody in the media has alleged that Milo has spent a dime of this money. It's uh, that hundred grand is just in his bank account. I doubt he's spent any of it on, um, you know, clothes, Botox or injections, like or, uh, uh, yeah. rims, or yeah. uh, activist Colli- collagen, <laughs> collagen injections, uh, plastic surgery. Um, thing, yeah, liposuction, uh, um, shoulder pads. Having plans, yeah. yeah, yeah, shoulder pads. Um, no, Milo has not spent a dime of that money. The scholarship's been delayed a year. All of the underprivileged white men who wanted to go to college this year just wait a year, just wait a year until you can get some of that. Scholarship yeah, money. take a year off. Okay, look, in solidarity, in solidarity with our intellectual brethren, Milo, uh, I'm gonna come out and admit, admit something. Okay, so you guys, you subscribers, you pay for the premium episodes. This is hard to admit, but sometimes that's not actually us on the premium episode. That's our, <laughs> we found some guys that kind of sound like us and we throw them like 20 bucks each to do a show as us uh, because some days we just, we don't have it in us for another premium show. Like Will Will has to make those Medicare mindset videos. Matt is like on a road trip. I'm jacking off. Like <laughs> none of us, we can't do it. We can't give you like two, 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 like three hours a week. So like, yeah, sometimes it's not us. And is that fraud? Yeah, technically. But like, we're trying to, we're just trying to do our best, man. Will gives so much of a day and Will has to walk his dog like at least twice a day. And sometimes Will is replaced on the show by me, Brendan, the producer. Oh wait, I'm sorry. I'm I'm no wait. Oh, oh, we're gonna this oh, out. Will, what the <laughs> fuck, man? S- sometimes Brendan does my work for me. Yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. Because we like, like we sort of sound and look alike. So I make Brendan uh, do the show for me, in addition to editing the show. Will is actually um, he's in a, he's in his century deprivation tank right now. Um, preparing for the next show he's going to do, which is probably sometime around uh, October. Yeah, no, yeah. Uh, so sorry, guys. Yeah, yeah sorry, this is. Everybody, but this is this is really well now. You know, we haven't been the be- we haven't been the most forthcoming, but it happens whenever you're involved in like a enterprise that makes more than like two hundred dollars a year. You're gonna like do some fraud. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Fraud is in the eye of the beholder. Exactly. The yeah, exactly. Who holds the money that is supposedly been defrauded? You know? So, again, uh, don't believe what you read about uh, Milo Yabba Dabba Duopolis. It's media gonna media, folks. And the cuck media is gonna try to cuck Milo, but he is uncuckable. And thanks again to Cernovich for changing my life. Absolutely. Yeah, me too. Before the gorilla mindset, I used to have like slumped over posture. I was begging women for sex and not getting it. Now, like since I've been doing his breathing exercises, I have an upright posture. Uh, you know, when I sit down, my hips are at a right angle with my back. Uh, I'm women are constantly begging me for sex. I'm turning them down. I can stop my heart at will due to gorilla breathing exercises. So if I'm ever in a mass shooting, I can fake my own death and the killer can walk over my body and I get up and I strangle him from behind and I'm on the news as a hero and women, uh, more women go up to demand sex from me. I turn them all down and it increases my power level to the point where the retained energy from not coming, I will be able to actually lock bullets with my chi energy and lead a new generation of indigo children so yeah just like thank you mike thanks to mike and mike